Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you doing? I hope you're doing great. So in today's video, I'm going to be trying the new L'Oreal True Match Nude Serum. It looks like this. It has hyaluronic acid and it's a serum. So it's not a foundation. It's not going to give you medium coverage or full coverage. It's very light. It's just a serum. I've tried this already twice before and I gotta say I like it if you like um, light coverage and just like an, your skin but better this is really good and it lasts all day so I was eager to show you guys because it, it worked for me and I have oily skin I like it a lot what I've been doing is I use my hard candy hydrating primer because I know this one is really good it makes everything last better So I discovered this because I had no idea this was new and it was out. I haven't heard really a lot of people talking about it. Probably because it's just a serum. But I saw Pampered Wolf do a review on it and she liked it a lot too. So that, that made me want to try it. It worked for her so it could work for me. It says shake well before using it. So that's what I'm going to do. And I like using a brush to apply this it says with your fingers but I don't want to get my nails all you know they're long and I don't want to get serum in there and then it's hard to get out and it's a mess so I'd rather use I've used it with a sponge and I've used it with a brush and I prefer with the brush you get a little more coverage with the brush than with the sponge the sponge tends to soak up the product too much they only have nine shades of this serum because they're supposed to match at least three skin tones of each shade so there's very light and then this one's light so this is the second to light I should have gotten with the lightest the very light one because this one is a little bit darker than my skin tone I can still make it work because it's not that heavy so I just take since it's so loaded I just take this much and then just work it in with the brush. It says you can build it up, but I don't want to build it up because since it's not my accurate shade, I don't want it to look too dark on me. As you can see, I can still see all my freckles, my spots, a little bit of redness, but it kind of mutes it down a little bit. It's not so harsh. That's why I like it. It's like your skin but better. I just like to build it up a little bit right here. It's like it makes your skin better more even now I do the same on the other side lately this has been my go-to since I rarely go out anymore I just use this to go to work run some errands and that's it I'm going to spray my face with setting spray right now before I use a powder because it works better for me. I prefer it that way since I have oily skin. Now I'm going to use the Beauty Bakery Flower Powder. I love this powder and this is in shade Oat Translucent. I'm gonna do my eyebrows off camera and I'll be right back. Eyebrows are done. I'm gonna keep this light because I just want a natural look today. So I'm gonna use this one from ColourPop. This one is called Amore palette. And I'm gonna use this, these two today.
I'm going to use this Boutique Defining Eye Pencil in shade Light Brown in the waterline. I think I got this at Sally Beauty's. Look at that. You could totally tell I have one eye more hooded than the other one. You see that? <laughs> I have so little space in this one. And I have more space on this one. And that just throws off the whole eye look. And I struggle with that shit always. So what I'm going to do is add this to this side. Very thin right here. I almost poked my eye out. Just to make it smaller so it could be the same as this one. I think that's better. Yeah, that's better. And now I'm going to put mascara. I'm using this one at the moment because this was really natural. This is All Night Bender. I'm going to add a little bit of bronzer. For lips, I'm going to be using this nude color called Prosecco Pop from CoverGirl. These are so good and they last all day. Lately, my lips have been really dry. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this one over this because my lips have been so dry. I don't know why. This is it guys. This is my no makeup makeup look. This is basically what I use almost every day <laughs> to go to work or run some errands. What do you think? Very easy to do. I do this actually if I'm not filming and if I'm in a rush, I could easily do this makeup in 15 minutes or less. As you can see, it's just very simple. And this foundation, I love it for that. For no makeup, makeup looks. <laughs> it's perfect for that. And I'm telling you, I've wore this. This is the third time I'm wearing it. And the other two times I had to wear a mask and it did not take off the foundation from my nose. So it's really good so if you made it to the end of the video thank you so much for watching give the video a thumbs up click on the bell to get notified every time i upload and i'll see you on the next video bye guys i'm gonna spray my face with setting powder setting powder it's not setting powder now i'm gonna use the <coughs> Every morning. I can't get that out of my head. Max, if you're gonna fart, fart outside. What? Stop being next to me every time you're gonna fart.